producer of our show, John Mantley, called me up one morning. He says, well, have you seen The Hollywood Reporter? And I said, no. And he said, well, get one and read it on page one. And anyway, it's just a little box thing at the bottom saying, gun smoke is canceled. And boy, he was madder than a, than a hatter. You know, he was a fighter and a feisty guy, and he was just beside himself, you know, to have it done in such a, uh, a callous way, you know. They didn't even have the courtesy to call him up and tell him, you know. So he was ready to fight right there. He says, come on over. We're going to think of some ideas for a new show, and we're going to get right going, and, you know. <laughs> so, again, uh, providentially, they called us up about three days later from MGM, and wanted us to do the television version of the How the West Was Won, which, of course, was a huge movie they had done years earlier. And uh, MGM owned it, so they wanted to uh, revive it as a television miniseries. Originally, I was just going to do a one part, you know, I think it was a three hour show or something. So we were off and running on that show within days, actually, of the cancellation of Gunsmoke. And of course, that turned out to be a tremendous hit, that first episode. And uh, so we got a big kick out of the kind of, <laughs> you know, we, I think, cause I think CBS had to feel a little odd about that, you know.